Oh, we got another cutscene. Oh, that's is that Heracles. Heracles. Yeah, I think that's Heracles. Is this our ship? It's too big. Yeah, it's way too big. But could you imagine? <laughs> yeah. What is that? That is Heracles. Heracles? Whoa, we gotta get out of here. It's yeah. gonna level the city. Yeah. I'm going to leave the city and continue my journey. What do you mean? They basically pulled the in the capital. Death Star. So keep Flynn waiting. It's for you to decide. Then I... I just want her to see Whoa, a dead body Whoa, we suddenly look way taller than I thought. What the? God damn, this anime is shit. Yeah, in the background of this scene, like, they don't even see it, but you just see the body floating away. <laughs> now that's what I wanted to hear. Yeah, maybe don't have your moment there right now. Okay. Did they almost just kill the princess with Heracles? Yes. yes. <laughs> Don't! It's too dangerous! Look who's talking. I'll be fine. You go on ahead. Come on, quickly! My, you're a stubborn one. <laughs> huh? Why is it taking off? Because it, it just it's got... just dropping Judith off. <laughs> it was her Uber. Yuri. Look, you gotta find your own little dragon again. You called in your favor, we're square now. I'm sorry, Flynn. I realize now I can't oh. just go back to the capital. He's like, this is poetic. Why? I can't hear you. You're on the other side of the I have some ringing in my ears from those explosions. <laughs> Look, Heracles Bard has made cannon. I think I suffered bur Can you heal this? Is this you something you can heal? You realized you'd like some Crackle? There are too many things I What is Crackle? <laughs> Surely after returning to the capital you can Nope. The voices of the people suffering in Nora Harbor never I thought reached she was the gonna say the voices in my head. <laughs> I won't achieve anything if I'm not willing to approach these problems head on. I've come to realize that during my travels. That's why. Do That's why I have to keep going. Do you still have the brain rot of whenever you hear someone say head on? You just think of this stupid commercial where it says head on. Apply directly to the forehead. No, oh, I don't God. know that. Oh, God. It was the most annoying infomercial ever. I don't think I ever saw that one. Oh, it was so bad. Your Highness. Take Flynn, it back to the capital. Get this back to the lower quarter. Yuri. See how she's on the part of the bridge that is like not supported. Mm -hmm. What if it just fell? <laughs> it falls in. She doesn't die, but then she like lands on the body. I'm going to start <laughs> up again. Give my <laughs> oh! to else. I'm going back to the capital. This is scarring. They're gonna walk away, and Flynn's gonna look down at the water and be like, "Is that where go?" Yuri. He must have died in the attack. A guilt. So that's what yes, you by doing and that explains the way. giant slash across his back. Don't don't question yeah, it. I finally made up it my solved mind. itself. That's fine, but what about Princess? Take care, Flynn. Yuri. I bye bye, I boy. Talk to you first, but here's to our new guild, Carol. Don't right. you have to like register that? All right, let's Can go. you just say you're in a guild? Hang around here much longer. Some of those knights are bound to come after us. Of truth. If you look at the, like the stats, do the people have the titles that it's saying that they got? That huge flying monster actually talked, right? You ever heard of a monster like that? I've never seen. Someone hasn't seen the like Pokemon that. movies. I don't think anybody <laughs> in the Hunting Blades has. Man, first that thing in Karabakram, and now this. The world's just full of surprises. I don't care how many lives you have, it wouldn't be enough to fight that thing. Yeah, 
Not even I feel like taking on a monster like that. Okay, so, um, maybe under... Character details? Status? Title, Downtown Boy. Oh, so you can choose what it is. Downtown Boy. Downtown's the first resident wanted by the Imperial Knights. The one who refuses to obey the law but instead takes justice into his own hands. Basic swordsman, skilled swordsman. All right. The vigilante. Attachment. Attachment? What the? Castle healer. Okay. Royal, Royal successor. successor. Condemned by a giant monster as the poison of the world? Uh, what's with this pink hair? <laughs> poison? Okay. Young hunter, agile fighter, determined fight. I love it how the agile fighter's like, uh, nothing, never mind. Yeah. Wait, shit. Um, Blastia hunter, beautiful lancer, great lancer. Okay. Okay, and then what does Repeat have? I know he has the uh, man's best friend, sinful sidekick, taking the sins of your friends upon your back. I, I have, have covered, covered buddy. buddy. That's so cute. I mean, not the context of it, but I'm sinful sidekick. Gotta be sinful sidekick. Carol, get the fuck out of here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so where do you think that we need to go? I now? don't know. Um, because. If we, here. if we go into our journal, does it say anything about what we were meant to do next? Proclamation today, the Imperial Council announced Rico is absolved. Yeah, was in other news, Flynn's promotion captain was being public. No, so no. I'm not sure what we're meant to be doing. Gets viewed 19%. So, I'm thinking maybe we need to move, like, back down to this area. Oh, maybe we need to go back to the city that we couldn't go out of on boats because of the magistrate. Yeah, now that's, that the that's dude's what I'm dead. thinking. Yeah. Or maybe we're about I to hear. I gotta get out of town, but I'm dying here. We barely left, Carol. Yeah. So, um, why is Judith coming along with us anyway? She wants to destroy Blastia, of course. With the circumstances being what they are, this is just how things turned out. I don't mind a few extra travel companions, but we do need to put in a little more effort. Just how far are we going? I guess Heliord's our closest destination, so at least until there. Okay. What? Should we rest a little once we get out of the city? Agreed. Okay, okay. Now let's get moving. Do we have Heliord on the map? I was about to check. Oh. Hey, you mind if I ask a question? I need to be sure of something. What is it? That big monster we saw? It was talking, right? Like our language. No, it was just yes. a mass uh, hallucination. I heard it with my own ears. You all heard it too? I guess it wasn't my imagination after all. And did it have a Who's British a accent? It's a human language. Wait, no, it was Jamaican. Just what is that monster? Hey, are you? <laughs> You're burnt by beer can. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, um, so that's died and hold. I would like to apologize to anyone who's Jamaican who happens to that's listen to that. That's lure. Hellerod. Hellerod. Okay, so okay. that's where we're trying to go. Okay. Got it. So, over that bridge. It's raining. So, yeah, we're going back to the... Um, this isn't the port city, though. No, because that was... What happened to Capua Nua? Or... 
I don't know. It's probably a good I don't time. think it's that port city, though. Looks like no one is following us anymore. People were following us? Like that giant How chicken. How can you tell? You see these ears? They're not all Intuition, for show. I suppose. Intuition? What do your elf eyes see? Anyway, we should be fine here. Let's rest for now. It's raining. We have no tent. At least I'm assuming we don't. When we have time to take a longer rest, we've got to decide a few things about our guild. Like the name and our mascot. And and the fees. Mm -hmm. What is it with you and taking breaks? What do you hope to accomplish by starting a guild? Accomplish? Hmm. I want our guild to become really big. And then someday we'll follow in the Dawn's footsteps and protect Dawngrest ourselves. Okay. That way, I can show him my gratitude for all the years he's defended the city. That's a wonderful dream, Carol. I'll just stick with the boss here. Huh? B boss Me? You were the first one to bring up this crazy idea. <laughs> I guess you're right. Can't have too public of a role. Then if they find his body. <laughs> It's best if we just keep our name in the shadows. So, mm -hmm. what's the first order of business? You're Calm the boss. Down. Yeah. <laughs> you make guilds sound like fun. Why don't you join the guild as well, Judith? Too much paperwork. Hmm, I wonder. Do you think they'd let me? I mean, it's between Carol <laughs> Is this a racism thing? <laughs> the most important thing is obeying the guild's laws. Those who break the laws will be severely punished, even friends or family. Oh god, it is just a uh, mafia. Yeah, yeah. The laws are the source of a guild's pride. Mm -hmm. No one can be admitted without making a solemn pledge to uphold them. Does it have to do with a blood oath? And what are the laws of your guild, Carol? Um... Everybody supporting each other and always acting with the interests of the guild in mind. And every other Tuesday, you must eat chili. It's a, it's a weird law, I know, but you gotta you gotta obey it. Striving to always gotta make sure that you're always getting enough potassium. Don't. What do you mean? Protein, chili. It's good guild, for you, and the guild or it can all. be. Get the iron in you. Mm -hmm. Do justice and punish the unjust. Everyone's opinion will be valued, so long as it doesn't go against these laws. Yuri, that's just what I. Right, boss. All for the guild and the guild for all. God damn. I'm sorry, are we ripping off yeah, the Three Musketeers it. now? Those are our laws. Yes, we are. We absolutely are. It looks like these will be my laws from now on as well. Sure, okay, okay, so she's joining. Like that? Yes, you've got me curious. All for the guild. I like the way that sounds. We're going to find out she's also a princess. Well then. I pledge to uphold the laws. For the guild's sake, and my own. Repeat refuses. Thanks for your concern, but it's all right. He won't mind. Your partner? A friend I was traveling with earlier. Huh. I didn't know you had someone like that. Okay, so from today on, we'll be your new partners, Judith. So does that mean that she, you can fly? I look forward to it. Me too. Then I. You can't join. No, you're a princess. Can't. Let's call it a day for now. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're legal. I don't. It would cause so many legal issues if you joined. Yeah. Estelle. Yeah. Now I get the I feeling how it's gonna how probably end. So long as it's not something where like Eoder is evil or gets killed, he's probably gonna take over the what? empire and then she'll join the guild. What if? What if? Oh hey, we can talk to people. I'm just saying. What if there's like a giant time skip? And Carol like grows up, and it <laughs> it's like uh, the time skip in Three Houses. Yeah, we're suddenly like these kids oh, that were in Yuri. school. You're like, oh, uh, okay, They're something happened. Veterans. Something happened. Hey, you're not asleep. No, is something the matter? No, I was just trying to think of what our next move should be. Yes, I didn't even think I'd be able to continue traveling with you. I'm still trying to decide if I should. You're really going to put your all into this guild, aren't you? I'd like to say I'm just going to go with the flow, but I went and bragged to Flynn about it. I guess I can't slack off now. Carol certainly seems happy. I'm a bit jealous. 
Oh, does Her Majesty the Princess wish to join our humble guild? If I asked you to let me in, would you let me in? No. If you've thought about this and it's your decision, I won't try to stop you. Yeah, you're right. I should really give this some thought. Yeah, because I'm assuming that means that you would, like, renounce your right to the crown. Yeah. Because the guilds are not under the empire. Well, don't think too hard about it. There's no such thing as dual citizenship here. Mm. <laughs> How can I decide? With a coin. <laughs> What, you're not asleep? Nah, I've been trying to think of a name for our guild. I'm gonna think of something really cool. Repeats punks. Sure, I can't wait. Yuri? Hmm? I was thinking about this. We made our guild without Where's first Carol's family? to its laws, didn't we? Didn't they die? Did they say that? Is he an orphan? I'm trying to remember if they did say if he was an yeah, orphan or not. Yeah, earlier today, right? So no worries. Yeah. Yuri? What's what with his it? feet? Oh, God, what is with his feet? Did you Are they super tiny? Up, or did you hear them somewhere? Like, it's just, just the black part, me. his foot? Why, were they no good? No. The, it goes into the blue it looks, part. It looks like a weird hoof. Oh, no, not at all. It's just... Those were the That's, exact same laws oh. I've been thinking of. Why did you have to draw attention to it? I'm really happy that I was able to make a guild with you, Yuri. <laughs> what a thing to say. Or are don't those get was... all mushy on me. Yeah, no, I don't know. <laughs> I oh Maybe it's like the a part of like the front of a boot. Maybe that's what it was, and the rest is in his pants. Yeah. But still how he was sitting that mm -hmm. oh. The super ultra courageous oh, brave. God. <laughs> that sounds like a name Captain Carol would come up with, definitely. Let's go with that. Then. Let's not. Gary, these are lasting decisions that we need to make. Mm hmm. Right. All right. Can we find repeat? No. Can never find the person that we want to talk to the most. Thanks. For what? You're staying up to keep watch, aren't you? No, not at all. You're so evasive. You're one to talk. Huh, weird. I always thought I was pretty straightforward. Do you see this outfit? I put it all on the table. Seriously? You haven't even given your real reason for joining our I thought guild. with the outfit of yours, Yuri, you were the same. <laughs> I joined because I uh, No, by to. comparison, he is very conservative in his dress. But for a male dress? He is a slut. That's it? No. So long as they don't go against the laws of the guild, everyone's wishes are respected, right? Don't worry. I said I'd uphold the laws, and I will. But in my own way. All right. Well, I'll get you to tell me the real reason eventually. So it was a coincidence that you were in Dongrest? Yes, I was. That's the truth. Isn't it lovely? Sure. Lovely. Thanks. For keeping watch? For talking. Oh, Repeat is here. Repeat. You're keeping watch too, huh? So, we started a guild. I feel so much guilt for what I did. We're a motley crew, but it should be interesting. <laughs> You're our number two. Try not to give the boss too much of a hard time. <laughs> you should get some rest too. So what do I do now? I talk to everyone. Do we just start walking down the road? <laughs> Maybe. No. Okay. 
Okay. How do we sleep? Um. What do we do? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Oh, tent, tent, tent. tent. Nope. Nope. Matt, Matt, God damn it. Do we talk to repeat again? Yes. What's that? Are you saying I should just trust you to keep watch for us? <laughs> All right, I'll get some rest. Hopefully in. this is not a Thanks mistake. Repeat. Although I'm guessing the stay awake is just so you could talk to other people. Yeah, if you would start with, with repeat. Yeah. Can find some work to do now that we've made our guild. Easy, Tiger. So, Estelle, what are you gonna do? I want to go looking for that talking monster. Good choice. If it was me he was after, I want to find out why. Don't feel like you'll be able to rest easy till you find out, huh? But how will you do that? How can you look for a monster if you have no idea where it is? I thought you were in charge of all the monster-related information. Don't ask me! Even I've never seen anything like that before. That was no monster. His name is Pharaoh. I'm sorry, what? So you know him. Do you know about him? And also, we're getting Egypt? I saw him earlier when I was traveling with my friend. And it was my friend who knew his name. So, Dragon. The dragons are Why weird chickens. Why would your friend know the name of something like that? <laughs> Where did you see it? It was on the Desier continent, in the sands of Kogor. So a desert That's continent, continent the to the has the pharaoh. Yeah. So, boy. The continent of Desier. The desert. You don't just go marching off to a desert because someone saw a monster. That's a fair point. That's 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 a good motto to live by. Yes. He's right, you know. I wonder if that fairy tale could be fairy tale? Something I read at the castle, a tale about a monster that speaks who lives in the sands of Kogor. There are always stories like that. Like the one about the monster in the sea who talks to people. I think you've got it backwards. Backwards? Such creatures do exist, but they have simply become the stuff of legend. It's like the saying, where there's smoke, there's fire. Yeah, but are you thinking of going all the way to a place like that alone, Estelle? Huh? Well, I... If we don't keep up this little bodyguard operation, she'll really march off on her own. What do you think? Let's take this as our first guild assignment. Hey, you're right. We'd be breaking our own laws if we let her go alone. That's right. But if this is a real job, we'll have to charge Estelle our fee. God damn it, Carol. Oh, we don't need to worry about something like money, right? No, nope, we have no a lot. Exceptions. Money is a necessity for running a guild. Don't worry, we're loaded, Carol. Um, I'm afraid I'm a bit short on funds at the moment. We just hand her money. <laughs> In that case. Why don't we just figure something out later? An okay, I owe I you. So let's all go together. Okay. Do Looks you like take credit? This way we can all continue the journey. Do we get a ship? Give us a ship. We just want the ship. Like, I don't have any money, but would you like a royal ship? All right. Super ultra courageous braves, fall out. Judith is hearing the name for the first time. What is that? Huh? That's our guild's name! It needs to be a different name. We can't go with that. Thank we you, Estelle. easy to say that has a real snap to it. Oh, really? Well... How about something like... Brave Vesperia? It's the star that gives off the brightest light in the night sky. The brightest star! Cool! Brave Vesperia. Hmm. I like it. Let's stick with that. Okay, that settles it. Let's get to Torum Harbor and charter a boat. We're off on an ocean voyage to the continent of Desire. I heard boat. I heard boat. I heard boat. Cute, I'm on a you? boat. <laughs> uh, who needs it? Either way, we can't get to Torum without passing through Heliod. 
I'd also like to see how they've been doing since the Blastia went out of control. Oh, the town's in ruins. Yeah, that was oh. pretty crazy. It's like the new Chernobyl. Oh, Heliord is where we right. were and we got we our pardon. For a quick look yes. The city. So, first to Heliorn, then from Torum to Desier by boat. Okay, I'll try again. Brave Vesperia, fall out! Brave Vesperia. I want to see what that title says. Mm -hmm. Yuri, I was a little surprised to hear that you're starting a guild. Well, it's not like I'll be doing it all on my own. Did Carol give you the idea? Yeah, but I've been thinking about it myself for a while now, too. I quit the Knights to find my own way of doing things. But I hadn't done anything. What Flynn said to you back in the port town, that got to you, didn't it? Nothing that guy says could get to me. He doesn't like to admit his feelings, does he? No. Sure youngest guild leader in history. Maybe there's a reason for that. Watchers like, no, 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 you gotta be of this age to start a guild. Like, mm -hmm. even we have standards. We're not trying to get child soldiers, kid. Oh my. Doesn't the city seem less busy than before? Everyone's dead. Yeah, this place has gotten a lot more ghost town. Oh, maybe everyone is actually dead. Now that you mention it, maybe. Huh? What's wrong? In Dongrest, I heard that the construction work here is so brutal that tons of people have been fleeing. I don't know if that's true or not, though. Huh, interesting. Remember that guy that we saw that was just behind all yes. the- Yes! <laughs> it's all lining up now. Mm-hmm. She has to do something about it. What do you mean? You can see it on her face. If that's the case, we should go to the inn and have a strategy meeting first. After all, we need to go check on the Blastia, too. Yeah, and it's not like Estelle can just let things go. You can't just ignore people's problems, can you? You can. I know, I know. So then, let's You can't, but, I inn. mean, in theory, you could. And sometimes you, sure you should. Mm-hmm. He's so happy that he was able to start a guild with Yuri. Hey, it's not like I did this just for Carol's sake. But you care about his feelings, don't you? Yeah, well, come on. We should hurry to the inn. We picked a name, made laws, got our first job. We're a pretty respectable guild now. But are three members really respectable? Why not? The dark we got repeat? The Four. Four. Are you Three saying he doesn't count? Down. Do you not Quality count the captain? Quantity. Or the, the people leader. Get to be a headache. Maybe. I prefer a small group. But you can't follow in the Don's footsteps and defend Dongris without a few more bodies. Yeah, I guess. But if we just put one foot in front of the other, I know we'll be big someday. So then you're saying we can take it easy? No way! We gotta give this guild 110%! <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Just get a quick save in. Mm -hmm. 